What's happening folks and welcome to an episode of the Bamboo Let's Play. Today we've got a massive second leg against Real Madrid and potentially a Champions League draw if we get through that first leg. If you've not seen the first leg, I highly encourage you to go watch it. Um, crazy game. We've also got to back up our decent run of form in the league with a win against um, today, against uh, we, we, against Hanover. Sorry, I couldn't remember their name. Welcome to episode. Hit the like button, help support the channel, and let's get into action right now. So on the screen right now, as you can see, we've got the game against Hanover. We are we should be winning this game. We're at home. We're in good form in terms of like wins, and we're scoring goals on a decent rate now. We've got like three goal, three plus goals in the last four, last three games in a row. Which was the interesting one where they um, just destroyed our defense, which has been pretty solid throughout the season. Mainly, we're still on the laptop, guys. Um, it it it's not fun to record when you've got the laptop wailing away in the background here. Um, but yeah, here we go. Right, so we're gonna go with. I'm trying to see is anyone worth resting? No, Kane's back in three days. I doubt he's fit for the Madrid game, which is disappointing. Um, that tie is not over, by the way. That tie is nowhere near over, um, by any stretch of imagination, because of the my history on, on this game is of a great start liner. Oh, you can't send him off for that. I'm gonna say you can't send him off for that. Um, yeah, my history on, on having Leeds Champions League against Madrid is not great. They always need to turn it around. We'll see what happens. Christensen again, push on the ball, lads. We 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 we're aggressive, right? I'm I'm gonna, I'm gonna change things right now, just to try and prove that. Do that. Would you edit that actually, and then go attacking? Where is it on here? There we go. Attacking. Full press. Go for it. That's what we do. Because we need to just put pressure on these on these teams that maybe can't play the ball out as well. Lamed on the right hand side. Can he find the cross? Ben Torres, never scoring from there. Never scoring from there. If you're going to shoot from that angle, you've got to go on your left foot, I think, to have a better chance of scoring that. Barella with a corner kick. Edge of the box. Don't, don't, didn't tell him to do that. That's what I tell him to do. And that's why. It never works for us. Big kick here for... Oh, it's pathetic. Dude, come on, wake up, wake up, come on. We are just not playing well today. We've not created a single opportunity yet, other than Fern Toy shooting from a stupid, stupid angle. We can't have passed the ball to midfielder. Now pass it through. Now, now move. There you go. They just they do the right things a lot on this in, in, in this team, but they just take long too long to do it. Like it's obvious pass they're going to play, but they just they, 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 wait, they hesitate too long. Cafoy in the box cleared. Gnabry is the box to Barella shoots one nil. Cafoy is a side check. You can't give offside. Who are they checking for offside? Go give. Who, who are they checking? Actually, California has been great at attacking outlet in recent game, game games. So this ball, who are they checking for offside? It's got to be the. It's got to be Grassi, hasn't it? Yeah, it's got to be Grassi there, isn't it? Is, 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 is it Grassi? Yeah, he was in line with the goalkeeper, but he's not. He's not offside. He's in line with the defender, who's basically new man. Um, yeah, so 1 0. Great start. Great strike from Barella. Give me a second goal, isn't it? That's the key thing now. California again with that threat down that side. In the box, it goes again. It's just causing problems. Barella again into the box. Hits it again. Almost scores again. Really good strike from Barella. It's not something I've noticed in doing these till, till just today. Half time, a slow start to the game, but we've picked up a little bit in, as, the, as the game's gone on. Um, the PC is really wailing away now with trying to cope with all the recording on this. Um, we could do well, we could have been better though. Um, just to get the second goal, position is there. The chances are being sort of created. Fern should have done better with the post with Barella as well and also scored a goal. Just get the second goal and then just keep maintaining the same possession football that we've been doing and we should be fine. In theory, free kick here. Is that always pass it to Yamel? Play it. Please see that pass. It's gonna. You, 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 you don't shoot from here. We've got a passing option to ML here. Almost scored though, doesn't he? Yeah. Just things are. If I tell him to do that from a set piece, I'll do it every single time. So I don't want. I don't. I don't want him to do it every single time. But that occasion there, I thought the pass was on there. He could even play it on the box. Antonio Silva. He even played the guy behind him and used ML as a shield to allow the guy to get in the penalty. But 
in the post, so at least it was these attempt. She's eerily too comfortable in terms of like general football not being a threat from Fern Torres has scored there we go I was going to say it's, it's, it's grim well apart from the fact we haven't got a second goal it's too easy um, let's just make changes now players off that we want to rest going into that well not, not going to get much rest other now but we can do it anyway um, just to give them a bit of a break going into that um, it's now 2-0 and we've been comfortable in possession um, Fern Torres has been a good signing um Overall, California has been brilliant. This is, he's threatened on that side, obviously not on this occasion, but generally speaking. Grassi there, good ball in the box. Fern Torres just wins the header. 2-0. There we go. I mean, even if we get absolutely tonked against, uh, against Madrid, which is very likely to happen based on my form, um, my history on this game, then um, I just I won't get the... the oh, keep it careful. Keep it... Do what Costi needs to do. Yeah, Costi needs to work on his on his um anticipation because he's like... He, he, he just... I don't know, man. Picano. Again, the, the, the safe pass was to the keeper there. To the fullback. Okay, Barella, fair enough. Ruin it. Got to be stronger than that, mate. Again, more aggressive. There you go. Not you, Lamy, on your card, mate. Again, overplaying this in this area. Just play it before quickly through the channel. Yeah, overplaying it and he's allowing it back in position. Right. Move it forward. 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 Now, could turn and play it forward there. Come on. Be braver. Gula. Barella, Rooney, he plans to shoot off the post. It could have been four, three or four this, couldn't it, really? And it wouldn't even be his exaggeration, honestly. We've been dominant in this game. I've just we've not been as clinical as we were against Real Madrid, though. I'd argue also been more defensive minded, but it's less an opponent. It looks like it's going to be a win by two goals to nil, unless we get a late goal here, which things happen. Things happen. No, it's the chance for Antonio Silva. And that's, ha that's full time, not half time. Full time. Oh, yeah, yeah, it is. <laughs> full time. Bayern Munich 2. Hanover nil, comfortable result. Uh, they didn't really create a threat, create a chance really in the game, did they? Uh, but the big one now is Real Madrid, and we need how he came back for that if, if possible. Uh, we are six points clear at the top. Um, but obviously, still got to play a game. We've got to play their game yet, um, which I don't know who they're playing next. Are they playing? Glad back. They could drop points in that potentially. Well, I'll, I'll date you on that when it comes up. Actually, I'm actually talking much because it's, it's going to be right now, isn't it? But yeah, um, the PC, I don't know if you can hear this. It is wailing away in the background. Um, anyway, um, but do we still go dropping points here? I suspect they won't. But I could really do them dropping points in the league. Please say they go drop points. The draw is completely fine. So we're six points clear. We're not far from the end of the season. And what is the rules on this? Memory. It goes on goal difference and goal scored. Okay, goal difference and goal scored. Well, we are the top for goal scored by double. And we've also got a really strong goal difference. So technically, you could argue it's seven points clear if you want to go by goal difference and goal scored. Or you can argue eight points clear if you want to add each one as a point. You know what I mean? So anyway. We did next. Let's go. Okay, match number two, guys. Here we go against Real Madrid away in the Champions League. And they're still doing the same formation. So we're going to just do a quick check. Harry Kane's back, by the way. You'll see it in a second. That he's on the bench. But can he play today? I'm not going to risk him. I don't want to get him injured. Because uh, we've got, I think, the Champions League game. Round 16 happens not long after this one. But we'll see what we get, obviously, if we're going to show that. So we're going to do this. Because this is what happened last time. When we switched these two around, um, Kyle was a lot better dealing with um, Lisa Jr. Well, I'm not saying it's going to work again, but it might do. Also, Barella is not fit. Sorry, Barella's not available because he's suspended. So that is annoying. Um, but we shall see. So, um, what did we pick up last, last time? Yeah, and I'm aware. Sorry, folks. Uh, I'm aware that there was an issue with and Palfoy's injuries taking into the game. Great. There's this, I try and do calling settings to try and get better quality of calling, but I think that's what I caught with it. So I do apologize for that game there. I had issues with the with jumpingness or lagging or lagging. Um, but um I've changed it back to the usual settings. It should be okay in this one. Vicky K for Madrid, Kern the Pelanceria, Clebo Picano, Guassi. Play down the line. I if we if we, if we can solve the first goal here, Guassi you gotta be you gotta do better there. 
Get across to him. Get across to him. You're the fullback. Get across to him. Goal. You're not missing this. Wow. Again, fullback, fullback, fullback. You've got to be more aggressive in that position. I don't like players backing off. It just gives attackers free reign to attack you. They, give, they get confident you're backing off them. Be, be aggressive. Fernando Torres. Grassi, play it. Not backwards. Go to the fullback. That was the option to play. Guerrero. He can, he's injured as well. Luciara. Can I bring? Yes. Oh, I think, I think I think it's an offside there. Yeah, I think would have been offside. But like I said, every time I get left back injured, and again, I get another injury. Goal given. Every time I get left back injured, I get more injured. I get striker injured, or I get injured. It's ridiculous. Um, Gnabry can't miss. What a what a finish that is. That's a massive goal in this time because we've now got a four goal in the margin. Um, brilliant. Um, stunned. Don't mess around. Right, we're not doing this. This isn't. We're not playing out of defence either. So why are we doing this? Again, if they're under pressure, boot the ball because they don't stand there with the ball. It's the animation that's the problem. Why is this? This is the weird animation. Look, he's got a first time pass by the keeper there, but he doesn't do it. Sit. Don't risk it. If this unit is right there, he's going to get that ball. Boot it away, Gundogan. I'm going to break you for that. That's just ridiculous. Okay, Guerrero curls it in. Back out to Guerrero again. again. Guerrero's got... Again. Come on, lads. Fern Torres. Pass. They draw on the ball too long. Look, on there. Pass it first time back to the defender. Keep the ball moving. Don't let them get a chance to close you down. That makes them hesitate things. Guerrero. And the penalty show you. Why are you shooting? Why are you shooting? Why are you shooting? We need, we need, we need another goal. I think three goals can be disappeared dis like that against Real Madrid. Guerrero with a corner kick. Dings in the penalty area. Cleared. Gundogan flicks it back. That's another corner kick I think it is. I want to take Guerrero off, but you can't just keep doing this, FM. You can't get injured all my players in one position every single year. It's ridiculous. I don't understand why it keeps happening. And Quirk qu catches it. I want a boring game, I want to say right now. That's what I want, a boring game. Because I want to get out of here, get out of here with this, this beating Madrid in Champions League. Let corner kick. Edge of the box. No one closing him down. Over the bar. It's a common thing. You can't stop that. Um, at least... I've tried many occasions trying to stop that happening, but it seems to keep happening. Half time, one one. I'm delighted with that. Um, don't get complacent. Can I? Can I change this? Set pieces, defend. Depends who it is, though. Antonio Silva, no. Goretzka, yes. Um, no, I want to mark edge of the penalty area. Edge of area. There you go. Um, just so there's someone there. Because it might mean then they won't play that pass. Because they might think, by the time I played it, the guy might get it. Like we did with the goal we conceded. So that's the idea. But I want a boring game second half. I don't care. But the, the, the drama was in the last game. I want the boring second leg here. Gundogan, stop doing those passes backwards. You've done it once and you gave it away. Stop doing it. Be more certain with passes. They're, they're really, really poor today. It's like he's just doing the bare minimum to get it there. Rather than actually get the make sure he gets it. Lima, good ball. Musliara. Can he find a cross? Lima. Yamel. Gnabry. They're all playing this a bit too much. Great on opponent, yeah. Right. If you shoot one more time, I'm giving you a fine. Stop shooting. You've got a passing option on. He's got shoot left off someone. I think it's because we've got this on here. It's, it's conflicting, but he should still should ignore his instructions. He should ignore the main... If I've told him specifically not to shoot, in theory, he should not shoot, but clearly he wants to. Ball in the box. Just I don't trust myself to win this tie. With, with, again, get him. Go across to him, Lima. Oh, that's fine, he's our play. Just, we, need, we need better players in the, in the fullback areas. I just want a boring game. I don't want any highlights. Why can't we just get the ball and keep it and have a dull game? Are they, are they, are they, are they moved over? Are they, no, they haven't switched sides with him. Okay, I thought, okay, he's just moved across there. I thought they'd moved over the side. If they had done that, I'd have done the same with my fullbacks, my defenders. Lima. Fern Torres. Lima. Another goal, and I think we're through. We keep getting the ball. I don't like he's getting the ball away. 
the one in the fucking box, bro. No, you stupid idiots. He's going away from goal. Stay on your feet. Don't dive in at Bacano. It's a penalty. Idiot. Absolute moron. Stay on your feet. Stay on your feet. It's lazy defending that. Come on, Diego Costa. Save his penalty, mate. Nope. Again, a goal conceded down to individual areas. We don't concede goals down to quality. That is the goal we didn't want to concede. Now he's giving an impetus now. We can get back into the game. And so on so he's like getting head on the target from those positions because he's getting some get taking Gnabry off. Okay, he's absolutely knackered and he's got a knock. So we're gonna bring on Clinsley Coleman. And I want to take him off, but I have no one to bring on at left back. Because the game just wants to give me an in one position where I need it. Oh. There we go. This is this is this is this is the this is the this is this is this is, this is, this is what I'm afraid of. Just this team is just gonna fold now because we did just I just can't beat these look. Oh, yeah. That's perfect. He's, he's, he's on side, but it's a pathetic goal. Just don't switch on. Wake up, a lot of you. One goal conceded in the second half, and just, that's a goal. Wow, just slide. Wake the hell up, all of you. Wake up, wake up, wake up. It's a simple ball in there. You can't let Cruz get the ball in your box like that. You can't. Wake up, focus. Come on. A goal now would be brilliant. Of course, we can't get it. Because we have apparently got 20 catching and reaching. Hurry up. No. Ignore him. The guy is the ball to go to get. Tackle him. Tackle him. Not in the penalty area. Oh, for God's sake, guys. You can't do that. They just, they just don't have any kind of ability to tackle the ball, do they, today? Look, you've got to foul him there. Someone's got to foul him. And then look at the guy who scores the goal. Who's going to mark him up? It's Antonio Silva again. Just doesn't switch on defensively. He's so poor at the back. Like I said, this game is just coded and rigid and impossible to beat in, 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 in its ground. Gundogan getting the ball away again. Tap foul him. Don't do it. They're panicking now. They're panicking. They're not thinking straight. They're not thinking straight. Calm it down, boys. Slow it down. You're panicking on the ball. It's Madrid. They're coded to win these win Champions League games against me. It's just, again, pressure on the ball. Again, they just can't cope. Get back in position. Get back in position. Mark, Mark, Mark. Stop running out of position. Stay in position. Hold the shape. And stop doing that. Give us a chance. They just do not understand how to jump. Jump. Pass the ball back. There you go. Keep possession. No, Guerrero, you moron. It's not a difficult pass, that, mate. I told you. It's just fucking rigged, this. It's so rigged, it's untrue. Just pass the ball to each other and kill the game dead. Look at that. Ball over the top. Rubicano just does not want to try and run after him. And then once again, no one marks the guy in the middle. Just, just stop running. I can't make any changes. I can't bring anybody on to, to fix this. All the players I've been on are all out injured. All they got to do is keep the ball and not wet themselves. And they can't do it. We're going to go out. Like I say, they're just, it's just, it, I got a 10 goal lead and I still lose against these lot. The game management from them, just keeping, again, they're just panicking on the ball. They're lumping balls forward now and not thinking about it. Lima is like a poor game. Yeah, there's just, there's, just, there's just no way we can cope with them. Defend, 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 defend. Drop your line back and just stop them running behind you. All they've got is that running behind. They, we, we, we just can't deal with it. Just drop back. Get some defensive shape for five minutes. Again, Grassi, work harder, mate. Work harder. To press down. Again, press him. He's Modric. Press him. Press him. Gundogan, press him. No penalty. And he's off. He's off. Again, they just have no... 
I'm sick of this bloody, this bloody team at the moment. They have no sense of, the, of urgency to defend properly. We're out of the tie. We're out. Like I said, it doesn't matter what I do against these, against this lot in the, in, the, in the stadium. Look on the bench. There's nobody on the bench to bring on here to fix this problem. There's nobody. It's just Madrid. They are just unrealistically good in this game. I can't bring anybody on. There's nobody in defense I can bring on because they're all something injured. Because this game just wants to do that to me all the time. I can't make any more subs. I can't even make, make, even make any more subs. I'm going to take. I'm going to take Gundogan off. Can't have him in defence. Can't make him more. Can't make, can't make him more subs. Can I? Yeah, that's, that's what I've got to do. And just pray to God the shit. But they're going to score this week, can't they? Like I say, it doesn't matter what I do against Madrid. They always beat me. Yep, yeah, and we're out. Like I say, it's just a coded Madrid. They're just coded to win these games. Um. Yeah, get screwed. I don't care. 8-7, get screwed. And again, game over. Yeah, it, it was just coded. There's nothing I could do about that. There's no... I couldn't choose the full-backs. And defenders are too slow to deal with them. Furious. All you had to do in that second leg was keep the ball and not wait, not wait, not wait, not wait yourselves. And they can't do that. Um, again, injured, injured players everywhere. Even though I'm rotating, I'm still getting injured everywhere. It's ridiculous. The fitness levels of this team is absolutely a joke. Um, too many players just get injured and there's no reason for it other than the fact the game just wants to screw me look at that I've got one, two, three, four defenders not available it's ridiculous I get one defensive injury I get all of them I get one striker injury they all get injured then it's ridiculous absolutely ridiculous like I said three goal margin doesn't matter against Madrid it doesn't matter unless you've got a ten goal margin with two minutes to go you're not beating them on this game but this team is just not good enough at the back. Antonio Silva is pathetic. He's borderline pathetic. He just does not track runners at all. He's got fifth anticipation and fourth in position. He doesn't play like it, honestly. He really, really doesn't. Um, you, you can't accept. You can't say to me that that is acceptable. Defending, you just can't. Anyway. Next episode, I'm not sure we're going to come back now because the, the, the season's almost done anyway. So we'll probably do these four games of actually who's who's hiding the table? Like, okay, so I see who we've got um so Wolfsburg and Frankfurt maybe next episode. Um anyway, that's annoying. It didn't matter what I did there, there was nothing I could do about it. I had a low defensive line. Um and they just stopped defending. They just they they defend the fullbacks are just not good enough. Um, they weren't first choice either. Limer can't play right back, but he's got to at the minute. I've got no right back available now. Just like I say, I get one injury in one area, then I'll get I get some injuries all in one area. It's 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 borderline pathetic. Anyway, um, like I said, we should lost injured anyway. It's just the fact we had a three goal lead and we still had a four goal lead, and they just could not keep the ball. All they had to do was keep the ball and be anyway, but they can't do it. Anyway. Champions League over. Didn't think we'd win it. Um, we were really poor anyway. We didn't. We better go out of the league phase. Um, anyway, catch you in the next episode. I'm annoyed because this team is just incapable of maintaining level performance against against top sides. Um, against any top side in Champions League, we just fold. Um, anyway, next episode: Wolfsburg and Frankfurt. Hopefully, we can get some wins and get the league secure at least. But yeah, I'm annoyed. Until next time, thank you for watching. Hit the like button, subscribe. I'll see you all next time.